If you're vaccinated and hoping to be able to ditch the mask and social distancing at work, you're going to have to wait a little longer. State regulators had planned a vote that would have made that possible last night, but instead kicked that can down the road. ABC 10's Zach Fuentes in to explain what happened there. Well, Walt, the proposal the Cal OSHA board would have voted on was made before the CDC changed its mask guidance for fully vaccinated people. So if they voted in favor of that original proposal, the soonest workplace restrictions could have been dropped would be July 31st. And that is, of course, more than a month after the state is set to reopen. So this vote that would be happening June 3rd could change that original proposal, bringing that date to the June 15th state reopening. Now here in California, infection rates have dropped a lot from the beginning of the year and more than half of the population has received at least one vaccine dose. But employers told the board at yesterday's hearing that that makes the rules less necessary. Worker advocates, though, said having half the population unvaccinated means that precautions are still needed. Now, the abrupt relaxation of mask policies at some retail and grocery stores has left some workers trying to sort out what the new environment means for their own safety and relationship with customers because some workers don't trust customers to be truthful about their vaccination status. So again, the new vote is June 3rd to see if workplace regulations can be eased on June 15th when the rest of the state reopens. And five days before that June 3rd vote, Cal OSHA's board has to have a reworked proposal in place for the public to review. So we're a little bit away from seeing what that new proposal could be, but there is some light at the end of the tunnel wall. Yeah, there's still a lot of moving pieces before June 15th. So Zach, I know you're on it. We thank you.